What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Blaze from the Darth Blaze channel, and I'm here to bring you one of my most anticipated action figure unboxings and reviews of 2024, especially for Star Wars The Black Series. This one being Star Wars The Black Series, The Mandalorian from the book of Boba Fett with the updated body. Oh, man, I got to see this from Valley 559, and holy crap, this is like import level articulation. It's amazing. I think I want to get a custom cape for this bad boy, too, so... Yeah, this is going to be an awesome figure unboxing and review. So without further ado, let's turn this around and get right into the unboxing. Here we go. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we have the figure in all its greatness. That is what the front of the box looks like. That is what the side of the box looks like. The back of the box this is the eighth figure in the book of Boba Fett wave. So without further ado, just go ahead and open it. Yeah. Throw this to the side. Boom. Boom. Look at that. Greatness. All right, so... Got some tape on the gun here. Got some tape on the knife. So let's get that off as well. We got the awesome dark saber. And the updated jetpack. Looking absolutely sick. Oh yeah. The new updated dark saber, amazing, absolutely amazing. The updated gun, yes, this is updated, and it looks absolutely fantastic. And also, we got the vibra knife for the first time in the Mandalorian line for the Mando himself, because I think Cara Dune came with one. All right, now let's get the Mando out of the package. Take a closer look at him. Here we got his cape all tucked over here. Looking awesome. I dig it. I dig it. We got the shoulder pads right here on the new O-ring system. So they lift up and we got butterflies. Oh my goodness. He T-poses. Amazing. He can do the splits pretty good. Look at that. We got wrist rocker. Then we got up and down vertical wrist rocker right here. Boom. 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 Dude, this figure is amazing. Ab crunch. Dude, beautiful articulation in the toes and in the ankles. I didn't mean the toes. I meant the ankle rocker up and down, side to side. That would be pretty cool if it had some toe articulation. The back is looking awesome. So, you know what? Let's go ahead and do some figure comparisons with this guy and get these accessories on him and get him posed up. All right, guys, here he is posed up with his jetpack, looking freaking awesome. I love the colors on the armor. It's absolutely perfect for the Beskar on this one. Um, yeah, the only thing I don't like is the cape. I'm for sure going to be upgrading the cape. I don't like it. It's a crappy soft goods. I do love it a lot more than the old plastic one for sure, but I'm going to be putting my own soft goods wired cape on here for sure i think and it'll look a lot better so let's do some figure comparisons all right here is the mando with bo katan Kreese and grogu absolutely loving this jesus christ there is a lot of dust on this uh grogu stand i gotta clean that off oh my god um but yeah bo katan and mando look amazing together right here i absolutely love it this, the armor is just spot on, beautiful. I absolutely love this figure so much. 
but let's compare him with another Mando figure. I'm not going to get the one that has a removable helmet um, and has Pedro Pacao's face just because uh, that one is so far up on my collection. Um, like if I take him down, the whole collection is coming down. Don't want to do that. So I'm going to compare him with the uh, Season 2, Episode 2 Mandalorian from the Ice World with the spiders. Let's go ahead and do that. Also wanted to point out was the difference between the two uh, dark sabers. This top one is from the Moff Gideon figure, and this bottom one is from this Mando figure. A lot better, a lot better. I think there's also uh, this same dark saber, the updated one with the pre Vizsla figure as well. Let's go. All right, here he is with the ice uh, Mando, and to be honest, man, this everything about this figure is just better. The Paint on the armor over here is better. The articulation, there's no butterflies. This is stuck on the shoulder, so you can't lift up past that. Um, even the head, I think, is better on this Mando. The shape of the helmet is better. Um, the thighs, pins, pins, no pins. Um, articulation in the ankles and everything is better. The guns are better. The weapons are better. Uh, this... Is trash compared to that and even though that one's trash as well but just man everything about this mandalorian right here is such an upgrade and the articulation everything it is import level i think it's better than any mafex mandalorian you get you can get it's better than any uh sh figure arts mandalorian you can get this is the best mandalorian on the market right now so if you guys enjoyed this brand new mandalorian from the Book of Boba Fett. Make sure you guys leave a like, comment down below, subscribe to Join the Blaze Army if you haven't already. I'm Audis 5000. Peace, and remember to always stay blazed.